Hey guys, I'm Anthony from Hammer and Pine, and today I want to show you how to bring some peace and quiet into your life by upgrading your toilet seat. Almost all older toilet seats, as well as some new ones, come with a basic seat that does not have a soft or slow close feature. This simple upgrade will take you about 10 minutes to install and cost around $20 to $30. Home Depot, Lowe's, and the like will have many to choose from, but don't forget to check online home furnishing sites for an even wider selection. The first step is to determine the shape of the bowl. With some rare exceptions, toilet bowls will be one of two sizes, elongated or round, which is also sometimes called standard. Determining if your toilet is elongated or round is easy. Just look at the bowl, and if it's shaped like an egg, it's elongated. And if it's more like a circle, it's round. If you want to be absolutely sure, measure from the seat post holes to the front of the toilet. If it's about 18.5 inches, it's elongated. If it's about 16.5, it's round. The distance between the seat post holes will always be around 5.5 inches, unless you have some really fancy pants proprietary toilet. Now that you know that what shape your bowl is, you can go shopping. Toilet bowl sizes are standard, so you don't have to use a toilet seat that is the same as the manufacturer of your toilet. Look for something that looks good to you and has the design and the features that you want. If you want to stick to the brand of the toilet that you have, the brand will be stamped somewhere on the toilet, usually between the seat and the tank. First, remove the seat you want to replace. Look for the seat post bolts that hold the seat to the bowl. If needed, flip up or remove the caps to expose the bolts. Loosen and remove the nuts on the underside of the bowl. Some seats may have a nut and a washer. Others may be attached with a plastic nut like here. Finally, take out the bolts and remove the seat. Use the mounting hardware included with your new seat to attach. In this Kohler seat, insert the black tabs into the notches of the seat with the plus signs facing front of the bowl. Next, Put the new bolts in through the tabs and place the seat on the toilet so that the bolts are aligned with the seat post holes. On this Kohler design, if the seat is too long, remove the bolts and the black tabs, rotate the black tabs so that the plus sign is now facing the tank. Next, take the white nylon self-centering nuts and push onto the bolts as far as they can go. With one hand, hold the nut and with the other, use a screwdriver to tighten the bolt. Make sure the seat is sitting correctly on the bowl and tighten the bolts until they are secure and the seat does not move. Make sure you don't over tighten. Finally, snap down the cover caps of the seat and you are done. Stand and be recognized in silent praise. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like what you saw, please give it a thumbs up and let me know what you thought in the comments. And if you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing so you don't miss any more awesome updates like this. Mmm, squishy, squishy for that tushy. Do people really even buy this?